Tulsa County Sheriff's Office officially opened new headquarters this morning in North Tulsa. It's two miles east of Highway 75. As 2 News Oklahoma's Samson Tamajani explains, the campus is long awaited for a department needing a lot more space and it will also cut costs. Just a couple days after Tulsa County leaders called for a new courthouse to be built, Thursday they celebrated the opening of the new Sheriff's Office, more than seven years in the making. Money was spent for functional necessity only. The construction of the yet to be named North Tulsa campus took one and a half million dollars from the CARES Act and ten and a half million from the American Rescue Plan Act or ARPA. The finishing of the campus is an accomplishment Sheriff Rick Regalado says he's worked towards since he entered office in 2016. Though he admits any relocation would have been a massive improvement to downtown Tulsa's dilapidated Faulkner building. It's probably going to need to be condemned. I mean, it really was in poor shape. Um, but the spot is downtown, in the heart of downtown. And, uh, I, you know, I see a lot of room for, for growth downtown. The operations building is also new. It has at least four times the storage the Faulkner building has, with room to expand in the future. County Commissioner Stan Salee says relocating to District 1, his own district, made the most sense despite being farther from downtown Tulsa. This is the largest land mass in Tulsa County is District 1. Uh, uh, more uh, population in the, in the unincorporated areas. We had the asset here and, and why not utilize it with the, the, the facilities behind us and the firing ranges and it just is a great fit for the region. Sheriff Regalado also points out that despite rising construction prices and inflation, these four buildings of the new Sheriff's Office campus actually finished under budget. In Tulsa County, Samson Tamajani, 2 News, Oklahoma. And the Sheriff's Office says the only divisions that won't be housed at the new headquarters by the end of the year are those working at the jail, the courthouse, and the public service unit.